That uh, was significant. I think uh, that follows the pattern that I think we've we've displayed. Um, you know, coming into this negotiation, we're willing to negotiate, and um, you know, we felt like we were going to get some progress here coming into today. But um, needless to say, it's it's pretty disappointing that uh, we're at this point. Uh, it's just disappointing. Um, you know, like I said, we came in here today um, with those proposals, thinking that uh, we could really um, make some progress. And um, to hear those words um, kind of shuts that down pretty quickly. So, um, you know, it's just uh, in a nutshell. You know, it just it doesn't it doesn't look good right now. Sydney, when Gary Bettman this morning, he mentioned that there were some voters who were working that Oh yeah, completely. I mean, we we are because we all have the best interests in mind, and that's not just for ourselves, but the game in general. We want to play. We understand how important that is. Um, we want a fair deal, but um, there's no doubt everyone's on the same page. I mean, um, we're negotiating in good faith and with a purpose, and. Um, I don't know if there's much purpose from their side right now. Sydney, are we going to see hockey this year? I hope. Um, today wasn't uh, really a step in the right direction if, if uh, you know, that's what we're trying to do. But um, like Don said, sometimes that's the way things go, and we'll see uh, as things move forward. They continue to talk, and hopefully uh, they figure something out. Sydney, where do, you, where, do, where do you go from here? I mean, they, were, they said they were waiting for your proposal. Find you guys to put one together. Is it up to them to make the next proposal? <laughs> I don't know. I, I really don't know how that uh, how that works. Um, you know, we if they are expecting one, they got three. So I don't know. Do we get three back, or how does that work? So um, you know, I'm not really into the whole process as far as that's concerned. But I'd like to hope or think that if anyone's got something or some way to move this, that uh, they find a way to do it. Do you have doubts that there is going to be a change your revenue? 100%. Yeah. I mean, you look at the offers, it's it's pretty clear. I mean, uh, I think our message has been pretty consistent, and um, our offers have been consistent. I don't know if, if theirs necessarily have been, or I don't know if their willingness to negotiate has really shown through their offers. Um, they've been kind of hard-line offers, take it or leave it, and the timing of this one, um, you know, it's pretty ironic too with, you know, thinking that uh, the only way of getting 82 games in is if we, you know, figure something out in the next week and all of a sudden their offer jumps up a little bit. I mean, I think that's by design. So you think the league was playing on that, that they were, that that was a pressure tactic? You know, if you guys want to get 82 games, you want to get your, your full salaries this year, you better sign now? I mean, your guess is as good as mine, but, I mean, that's all those... All those hints or all that kind of leads to that, uh, you know, to that assumption, I think. So do you think this is a risk of guys like yourself, Jonathan, the stars of the game, are asked to do so much to grow with us? Do you think this kind of experience would impact your enthusiasm to do that? Like, like your relationship with ownership with the majority of the team? Well, I think when, when we do that, that's... Um, because we understand that that's come, comes with it and we care about the game, we want to do that. Uh, we believe in it and uh, we have a passion for that. And, um, you know, that's just, that's just part of it. But um, hopefully we're not at that point yet. Um, you have to separate those things. It is a business at the end of the day and it's the darker side of things. You know, nobody, nobody likes dealing with this. And, um, you know, I think that sometimes you have to separate that. But yeah, I mean, it's, it's not good for anyone. I mean, that's the bottom line. Yeah, I mean, you come with three proposals and um, thinking you got a chance to get a little momentum and um, get some progress. And 
it's shut down within 10 minutes. You know, it's it's not even given a day to think about or crunch numbers. It's shut down within minutes. So um, that doesn't seem like a group that's willing to negotiate. I mean, that's pretty clear. Take it or leave it. And Do you have the option of playing elsewhere, Europe or anything of that nature? Probably a little harder, yeah. I mean, that's... I think that's something that uh, everyone's got to figure out. And, you know, you try to uh, figure out where things stand. I don't think they're in a great spot right now, but um, you also can't make a decision a couple hours after something like this. You have to be able to kind of look at things. And, um, you know, there is still, still time. I mean, if, uh, if it's a week before, you know, we need to decide as far as getting a full season in, then there is still time. But this, like I said, wasn't... Uh, you know, very, uh, very optimistic, I don't think.